children of Israel. Because even though they multiplied, they were exceedingly mighty, uh -huh. that they were filled with, with the things of Egypt, the things of the world. Uh -huh. Right? The of the world, yeah. Because what, uh, you, let me just, before I get ahead of myself, uh, then in verse 8, now there arose a new king over Egypt, which knew not Joseph. Uh -huh. And he said unto his people, Behold, the people of the children of Israel are more and mightier than we. Come on, let us deal wisely with them as they multiply and come to pass that when they, they're, they're falling off any war, they join also our enemies our <coughs> and fight against us and fight so against us. get them out of the land. So what did they do? Yes, they they task masters uh -huh. to afflict them. To afflict them. But the more they afflicted them, the more they multiplied. The more they multiplied. And they were grieved because of the children of Israel. And they made them serve with rigor and hard punish and, and mark. Mm -hmm. It's almost uh, the same scenario of Adam. Mm -hmm. You know, a lot of uh, people work, but they don't serve God in their labor. And, and, and that's, that, that's when, 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 a, when, a, when, when a table was turned yeah. in your life as a believer. Uh -huh. Most people will not cause their mental capabilities, their, yes, their mind, their will and emotions yes, to accept the fact that to get ahead on the earth uh -huh. and to get ahead according to our great so he says don't uh, forsake so great a salvation. Uh -huh. They won't accept that it, the labor plays a major role in the benefits on the earth. Uh -huh. <laughs> The children of Israel, what they did, when, when they got all that, well, I mean, they wouldn't build, what, the, the, the uh, idols. <laughs> right? Uh -huh. They built that golden calf, you know, uh -huh. and, and they did that in light of what uh, the Egyptians had. The Egyptians had. They didn't serve God with it. Okay. And, and, you know, many people today in church suffer for just their own self-work. You know, they, they, they don't understand that... They need to use their rage to understand scripture, to tap into the benefits of our salvation. These, these uh, people work under the iron task master, the iron furnace. Uh -huh. Look at Deuteronomy. Go, go to Deuteronomy. That, that's a hard way to live, you know, in any climate, in any, any uh, country. If, if I live unto myself, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. If I live unto myself, but don't apply the scriptures to my, 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 my one key that caused me to live a good life is my wage. Mm -hmm. it's, it's been proven forever. <laughs> my way. Mm -hmm. People that don't serve God use their ways to to, to, what, to build things. But you gotta say if it's if, if if his debt was good enough to pay for my wages of sin. Uh -huh. What would his debt do upon my, my, my wages of labor? labor. How, how, how can it change the way I work? Uh -huh. Or how can it change the way I live concerning the labor of my hands? What I say? Go to Deuteronomy chapter 4. Uh -huh. And look at verse 20. We get to say amen. amen. I don't care if a person take you out of the ghetto and put you in a beautiful place, but if you don't understand the wage, you'll still... Wind, a lot, wind up in a rut, you know, uh -huh. still wind up not understanding how to live. Because uh, you don't understand the scripture. Mm -hmm. Scripture is vital to understand, to interpret, uh -huh. to be able to, and, uh, to to get wisdom. You say, this is our wisdom, the word of God. Uh -huh. Jesus is our wisdom. Amen. Chapter, Chapter 4, verse 20. It, 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 is a, it's a, it, it is a prevalent reason why people uh, choose to learn, I mean, uh, to hold their own wage in their understanding of life. Because uh -huh. <laughs> look, because uh -huh. I don't care how the, the Bible says we live not by bread alone to them, mm -hmm. we I only live by my wage. That's right. That's right. You know, right. but right. the scriptures say we we live by every word that proceeds out of the mouth of God. Uh -huh. So that, 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 that can be. Uh, Against one another. Do I live by my understanding of my wage or do I live by every word that proceeds out of the mouth of God? 
uh -huh. what if that becomes to be, you know, uh, uh, against one another? What if my own way of thinking when I work is against what the Word of God says? Okay. Think about that. What if I'm using my own uh, labor against God Himself? Most people do it. Look, they work under the iron taskmaster. Look at what I say, Deuteronomy 4, verse 20. But the Lord has taken you and brought you forth out of the iron furnace. Mm -hmm. Amen. Even out of Egypt. Yes, Lord. To be unto him a people mm -hmm. of inheritance mm -hmm. as ye are this day. Mm -hmm. Amen. I don't care, but even if you bring some slaves out of a place that they go, that they went to the promised land and became slaves to that land. Uh huh. Look what? Because what? The average person, I don't care if he, the Bible said he gave them houses and vineyards, they use all that to what? To 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 begin to look at the people of the, of that land. Of that land. In other words, it's just like a believer constantly looking at. At the world. At the world, that's right. That's Even though right. the Bible says, love not the world, neither the things of the world. The, world. the lust of the flesh, the lust of the God of God, life is not of uh, 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 God, but of the world. Mm -hmm. Most believers, uh, despite how much they say they love God, they love their finance first. Yeah. And when, when you hear people say, put God first, they talk about first in your money. Uh -huh. Th that's such a, 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 a distaste for most people because their main objective is the preacher. Uh -huh. Yeah. Uh -huh. Forget God, but His Word says that man uh -huh. is a distraction concerning me getting. See, 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 see. What see. if uh, a, yeah. Man, yeah. a person yeah. himself yeah. becomes your biggest distraction and your biggest focus? Uh -huh. Well, to be honest with you, that's, that, that's, uh, that, that's uh, how can I explain this here? That is one of the same. Uh, best techniques. Yes. He put you focused on a person, but on not the God. person. On the person, right? Uh huh. He yeah. put, he can put you focused. Yeah. Yeah. And then yeah. what he do? He, he, he makes a big distraction. A big distraction. There's a reason why, like I say last week, is so many poor in not in the world. What about in the very house of God? The house of God. Yeah. You know, most people. He said the poor will be there always. Yeah. Quite naturally, it's gonna be poor people in the world. But should that same st statistic? Be in the church. But uh -huh. Jesus says he's the head, the chief cornerstone. The head, the chief cornerstone. Yeah, should, should, should the statistic that's in the world, should it be more prevalent in the church? It shouldn't be like No, that. no. Uh -huh. There's a reason uh -huh. why it's so much party inside the house of God. And it's because people, even in their wisdom, is not going to put God first put God in their wage. No, mm -hmm. they ain't. Not the average person. You, you. You are a, a very um, yes, unique. You think? If you go to, to church and put God first in your family, you, uh -huh. you, you, you're in the, in the not, not the majority, uh -huh. but you, you're in, 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 in the minority. But no, I don't know too many I people that, that do that. I you. I Despite how many people I, I've witnessed to and, and, and know, uh, they don't do that with the family. And yes. I'm trying to explain to you, uh, that's most Believers don't fall from the good life. The being that was wrong. They continue to make severe error in their ways. In their way. Not trusting God in your way. The children of Israel done this throughout the, all the their the, the, their life in Canaan. And the Bible says they became slaves in their good land. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. Let's look at the scripture. Even though God promised them all that, look, we have better promises. What? Better promises. What in our salvation package? Mm -hmm. Remember, remember, uh, all all the, the things of the old covenant was under the rule of the Ten Commandments. That means he said, if you continue to do this, uh -huh. uh, you'll live a good life. But what happened? Mm -hmm. Everybody default. Everybody default. It wasn't their obedience or their righteousness that caused them to inherit uh, the land of Canaan. Let's let's look at that. Look at Deuteronomy nine. What, what if I showed you in the scripture that it, and nobody in obedience caused them to go to Cain? Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Except no. even Joshua Kennedy still gave them grace. Yeah, grace. But, but even the shows in the text that, and it's something Callum said by our own job, it wasn't your 
right? But it was their wickedness. And that's what God said in the scriptures. Look at chapter 9, verse 4. Uh -huh. Chapter 9, verse 4. Uh -huh. You got it? Amen. 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 Look what God said about the children of Israel uh, pertaining to the land of Canaan. He says, Speak not thou in thine heart, after that the Lord thy God has cast them out from before thee, saying, For my righteousness. You know, how, you know how most people say the only way God gonna bless you a lot, I mean, through throughout life is obedience. Well, uh -huh. look at this. Uh -huh. God say, The Lord thy God has cast them out from before thee, saying, For my righteousness the Lord has brought me in to possess this land. He said, But for the wickedness uh -huh. of these nations, the Lord do drive them out from before thee. Mm -hmm. Not for thy righteousness, or for the uprightness of thy heart. So none of those things, according to the law, got them into the land of Canaan. Uh -huh. In other words, living by rules and regulation is not better than living by grace and faith. Uh, hallelujah. This is what I'm saying. Uh, salvation is not based on a bunch of rules and a bunch of regulations. Despite how people uh, quote scriptures, salvation is not based on your, your obedience or disobedience. It's only based on Jesus' obedience. It's based on one man's obedience. It says that in Romans. Yes. So, so for you to put a whole bunch of rules and regulations that was under the law with salvation, you default. It caused you to default. Okay. Other, it caused a person not to enjoy their salvation that God gave them uh, through, through his blood. Salvation is not based on rules and revelation, uh -huh. do's and don'ts. Uh -huh. <laughs> salvation is based on a belief. A belief. A belief. A belief, a belief. that God uh -huh. has given this to us. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. As a gift, yes, as a gift, not by works. Amen. Listen, Israel promises was based on laws and regulations. Uh -huh. And guess what? All throughout the Bible, it, it kept forfeit all the way to Jesus. And Look, I, all the things God gave them was taken. Mm -hmm. Every every tribe became uh, what? Uh, Slaves again. Read, read, read the whole Old Testament. Mm -hmm. They kept going into slavery all throughout the judges. Amen. 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 All throughout the judges, they kept all going into right. slavery. That's right. He said in verse 5, Not for thy righteousness, or mm -hmm. for the uprightness of thy heart, does thou go to possess this land. Uh -huh. But for the wickedness of these mm -hmm. nations, the Lord thy God do drive them out from before thee. Uh -huh. Now you got to ask yourself, God, Lee, wasn't the truth of Israel wicked? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. They was just as wicked. Yeah. You know what? In Solomon's time, they had more gods than the heathen nation. That's right. They had a god on every corner. That's right. An idol. That's, That's what the Bible said. Right. I'm That's trying right. to show you in the text that it ain't so much uh, you trying to stay in obedience to, to, to live the good life. No. It's you learning how to submit your ways. <laughs> There's a big difference. Right. You can be disobedient in God and submitting your ways and still reap blessings. Uh -huh. Yeah. You know, <laughs> any any continual disobedience can lead to death. <laughs> that, that's the truth. That's right. But I guarantee you, even in submitting your ways, being disobedient, you still tap into the good life. Because if, if that were true, then nobody could live. Amen. Remember, it's still based on Jesus' yeah. crucifixion. Uh -huh. It's based on Jesus, the Bible says, paying a price. Right. Hallelujah. Not so in the old covenant. The old covenant was based on them being obedient to the laws of God. Mm -hmm. Look what he says in this verse. From before thee and that he may perform the word which the Lord swear unto the fathers Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. He told Abraham that they, that they, and guess what? He did, but at the same time, their disobedience kept forfeiting the country yes, between uh, uh, and, and, and Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. Mm -hmm. they, you know, you, you already know only two adults and all the other people went in, so right then, right. It, was, it, it was defects to what was going uh -huh. on. Uh -huh. Look at verse 6. Understand, understand 
Therefore did the Lord thy God give thee not this good man to possess it for thy righteousness. Uh, so you, you see people that go by righteousness, that they are righteous by keeping the law. He uh, said, even the children of Israel did not get the promised land because of righteousness. Of righteousness. He uh, said, you are not going to possess it, possess it for thy righteousness. Mm -hmm. For thou art a still naked people. So anytime you try to put the old covenant with salvation, you you, you put yourself in, in, a, in, in a hardship. Uh-huh. Because uh -huh. what? Uh-huh. You most likely gonna forfeit that agreement. Uh -huh. Most likely you, you gonna uh, mess up on your point. Because mm -hmm. Jesus gonna say, no, I, uh, what I told you to believe is I I, I brought salvation. salvation. And I'm telling you, the only way people live worse lives in salvation is that they don't submit their ways. It ain't that. Right. It ain't that. Right. They, they're not. They're not experienced because of a lot of disobedience. No, and a lot of unrighteousness. No, you money wise, you you, you serve another God. It's just plain and simple. It's not all of those things you're trying to make. Oh, uh, you know a lot of people now is no, it ain't all those things. It's you yourself using your ways to stay in poverty. Uh -huh. It's no, it, it can't be. It can't be obedience or righteousness because if that's the case, the children of Israel would never made it uh, to the, the to the land of Canaan. Uh -huh. yeah. So you mean to tell me this also is part of salvation? No, no. The Bible plainly says that Jesus is our righteousness. Our that's why you got. That's yeah. why we need yeah. to understand yeah. the text. Amen. Amen. Look, he say they were still naked people, but guess what? He still let them enjoy that land. Yeah. And you know what? As they enjoyed the land, they still took the bulk of their wealth to serve others. Oh. Okay. Yeah. And, uh -huh. and, and I'm talking uh -huh. about heathens. Uh -huh. Not God, heathens. Yeah. He's saying, look at self, remember and forget not. Most people that start getting ahead a little bit, they completely forget God. Yeah, 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 God. <laughs> they don't come to church, they don't give yeah, that. Yeah, and then they wonder why they ain't run like they yeah, Now think about that. Yeah. I'm not going to give you nothing, God. Yeah. And I ain't coming to your house because yeah. I'm all preaching on this money. Uh -huh. They'll uh -huh. sit there and they put that in and die. Yeah. Ain't they going to take this situation? Yeah. You done already made your own laws. Yeah. That I don't like your preachers. They crooks. Uh -huh. Say they ain't stole nothing is the preachers. Uh, you're the biggest crook yourself. Uh, uh, you're crooking yourself. Uh, you you, 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 you man boozle. Oh no, you, 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 you living by a law that you can't find in the text. Uh, that ain't in salvation. That, that's according to the old covenant with, with the Pharisees. And you know what? I don't care how the Pharisees and the Sadducees robbed the truth of Israel. God still gave them their possession. Yeah, he never did. He did. Even when he came, he didn't take their position. Yes, he was there letting them rule, even they rule, even though they rule wickedly. Uh -huh. God said, Jesus said, these people are hypocrites. But guess what? As hypocritical what, uh, they, as they were, God did not take their position. Did not take their position. Look, they still judge Jesus, you know, when, when, when he, when he, before he came before power. That's right. That's right. Why would the servant of God let Evil hypocritic priest just uh -huh. his own son. Right. 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 God own son. God, they don't, God, they don't even move God. Uh -huh. God say he repay evil to the face. To the face. And I'm trying to tell you, even though, even when Jesus had his disciples and Judas was still in at will, he never stopped. It. He never stopped. That's right. That's but when right. you come with your own rules and regulations uh -huh. about the word of God, you're going to suffer, not God. Uh -huh. He knows we can preach. He knows, he he knows we can be all over. He already yeah, knows. Know. He never happen. Because yeah. what? He know your, your sin. Uh -huh. <laughs> we'll find you out. We'll find yeah. out. Yeah. Yeah. Any preacher old enough to steal from God, yeah. watch the end. Yeah. Watch the hardship. What, what, what's the sin? No, 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 look, God is a, is a commandment of chief uh -huh. of, his, of, his, of, his, of his body. He's a command of chief. He's a command of chief. Look, he sees everything for as the eye can see. Uh, he hears everything for as the ear can hear. He knows everything. And this thing to be known. Uh, he knows it. He knows it. People still fix their mind to outthink God. Oh, oh, they ain't going to give me nothing. Yes, I'm gonna give you the, the least I can find, and I'm gonna be my 
Jesus kept laying hands on the sick, great day. Why are these people were stealing? Jesus kept feeding the multitude with the Pharisees and the priests. They weren't doing nothing. In other words, Jesus kept being Jesus despite who was in charge of the church. No, no. Despite how I many Pharisees and Sadducees had good, I mean, were sitting on pa uh, pa pedestals of, of high places, it, it didn't buzz Jesus. It didn't buzz Jesus. It didn't buzz Jesus. Jesus addressed it and kept on moving. Kept on moving. He That's did. Right. He kept on moving. He still was the son of the living God. He didn't need to live He didn't need to live He still was the son of the living God. Jesus was setting the tone. People was following him. Oh, they said this man go. No, they said they start getting afraid. Uh, they realize this man go take all the position. The Pharisees start realize this man is healing sick. He raised the dead. He feeding people. He he gonna take all the position. And see when people are threatened by their job, that's what they want to kill. They said we got to kill. <laughs> they was threatened by their position. That's right. And I'm trying to tell you, there's only one thing keeping you in a rut. For his things, you see, you keep well this right now. It's your own way. Yes, Lord. You, you you have complete as a grown person authority over your own things. Nobody can tell you what to do. You ever try to tell a person what to do with their own money? Uh -huh. You try to tell them, make that they'll cuss you for everything you right. want to do. Right. 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 They do what they want to do. They do the things they love. That's right. They put their own stuff in a straight jacket. You don't have to follow them. No, I say, I don't keep giving to God. I don't care how much hell I take. Right. I haven't been out there with the, with the lust of food in the right. streets. Right. 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 God never lied to me. I don't care how many crooks I gave to an, on the ministry. I don't, tell, I don't care. Right. I did it because I love the thing of Jesus. Right. Right. Things of the world to confound the things that which are mine. Mm -hmm. 
and base things of the world, and things which are despised as God chosen, yea, and things which are not, uh -huh. to bring to naught things that are, that no flesh should glory in, in his presence. We just read yesterday in, in Bible study that uh, we, when we bear fruit, we bring glory to the Father. That's, right. That's what John said. That's right, right Evangelist? Right. When we bear fruit, we, we bring glory Amen. to the Father. Amen. But look at 30. But of him, but of him, talking about Christ, are uh, ye in Christ Jesus. In Christ Jesus. Who of God is made unto us wisdom. wisdom. He's our righteousness, righteousness. our sanctification, and, and he's our redemption. Everything we, 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 we decide to have is all, everybody say, in Christ. In Christ. In, in, in the Bible Christ. say we're not in ourselves, we're in Christ. In Christ. And that's our way to the good life. Good life. We use our ways to, to agree. You know what I'm saying? How can two walk together unless they agree? agree. Uh -huh. If he is the one that rules heaven and earth and he's, he's put it that we, the way we buy, sell, and trade is with currency, what would he do for a person that he's gave the new life? I mean, new life. born again. Born again. You know, he, he didn't gave me a, a new birth. Born again. Uh -huh. Do you think uh, that the things he did of old are better than the things of new? No. Come on. No he has given us his son, mm -hmm. his most precious jewel he gave to us. And guess what? Jewel. The Bible say they crucified him. Yeah. All right. All right. They crucified him, right? All right. And they did that, he said, for our good life. Our good for good us life. to live life and live it more abundantly. Mm. The Bible say he's our obedience in, in Romans 5 and 19. Mm. We get, he's our obedience. He's our obedience. Yeah. The Bible say we are saved not by our life. What did the Bible say we are saved by his life? Look at Romans. Well, what if you were saying not by what you do, but because of what he did? Yeah, I mean, yeah, you got to get that. You're not saved by what you're doing, right? You're saved by what he already done. That ain't me. That's the text. Look at, look at Romans 5 and 10. In other words, it's good to find it in the text. In the text. It is not something you just say it off the tip of your tongue. No. What if I show you in the text that I'm saved by his life? God put it so pinpoint accurate in the yeah, word yeah. so you, you can never forget. Never forget. The enemy can never bring it up again. Uh -huh. Because Jesus said I did it once for eternity. I did it once for eternity. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he, he bruised the serpent's head for my sake. Yes, he did. Look yes, at did. Romans 5 and 10. Yes, he did. Amen. You, you are the, the servant of that verse. Amen. Amen. Because it calls us enemies in this verse. That's right. That's right. You know what the Bible says how to treat your enemy? Mm -hmm. With love. Look at what he say. But if when we were enemies, yeah. Enemies, man. The Bible said we were reconciled, reconciled. to God. Uh -huh. How? By the death. By the death of his own son. And now he tells us, okay, get ready for it. Everybody, much more. Much right? more. Yes. Yeah, so you, you, can't, you can't look at God's face and say, I, I didn't have a chance to live uh -huh. my life. Uh -huh. you know, well, right. No. Look, he said, much more right. being reconciled. We said, when, when it comes to come salvation, mm -hmm. it's all about Jesus. It's all about and Jesus. not about me. Right. He said, uh, shall be saved, E.D., and uh, continue. Yes, what? By right. his right. life. Right. Right. And that's, that's, that's to the point. That's right. They'll come back and try, try to change that. That's to the point. I'm right. saved by his right. life. It don't get no better than that. Another verse tells me, uh, go, go to Ephesians. Go to Ephesians, what is it, chapter 1, when you get the same man. In other words, he didn't he did lay it out in such a way that I can benefit. If, if I, the Bible say, uh, we sold for the lack of knowledge. If I understand what to read, it's going to benefit me more than if I don't. Mm -hmm. If you understand the Bible, it's a benefit. Hallelujah. If I don't understand, it, it, it's a hardship. It's a hardship. I, don't, I don't understand. Yeah. It's a hardship. And you don't hardly understand things when your money is not in. Uh -huh. I don't care how hard it is. If you didn't put something in, I got to understand it because uh -huh. I put my money in. That's right. That's I didn't put my money in. That's right. Look at 11. 1 and 11. 1 and 11. That's Ephesians 1 and 11. Ephesians 1 and 11. Well, once you learn the text and you yes, believe, you you can start using your way as a key. Everybody say as a key. That's a key. He gave me the keys to the kingdom of 
And one of my most powerful ways on earth to keep people off my back is my way. You, you, you can smile at a person, though, if, if, if he can't uh, do you in. You, 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 you can, I don't care how it is, I, I can pay for it. I think about my son, Cullen. They didn't want to give me that car back because I thought I didn't have no money. I played them. I was like, no, I'm going to pay whatever you ask. I don't care how much it is, but you ain't going to fix it. But whatever you tell me, I'll pay it. Because I don't live by this. I live by the one that calls the <laughs> They, they, they kept it. They kept stalling. Uh, they didn't want to give it back. They wanted it. And I said, no, nah, you beat me. But you know what? I deserve to be beat because I messed my own stuff up with my brother. Uh, uh, I gave him $800 and said, hey, why? Because uh, what? You, you're going to lose in this world, but you, you're accustomed to being if you say, don't, 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 don't argue in the devil. No, no. Don't, don't go back and forth and say, you know what? It's yours. You know, this is your rule. Uh -huh. See, the, the, the world lives by rule.
by the word of God. Uh -huh. You know, most people hesitate uh -huh. con continually mm -hmm. after they've heard the word of truth. Uh -huh. They'll go back and everybody, look, get distracted. Distracted again. <laughs> yes, you will. Yes, you you will. can hear the word of yes, truth. You will. Yes, you will. But guess what? When it times to put the dividends down, huh? Dividends. Guess what? You, you just got distracted. Now, you know you can't hold on to it because it's many. Uh, it is a weight that's on the wage that's uh, humongous uh -huh. on the country, uh, on, on, the country. On, on the mind. On the mind. But the weight will get all over your will and your emotions. Mm -hmm. And it'll cause you to make a severe mistake. Uh -huh. Yes, it will. Uh -huh. In other words, the weight that's on the wage, the bills, the, the food, the gas, the water, the, 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 the problems of life, it comes directly on the wage of my hands and it causes me what? Be the Christ. Yes, it will. It'll cause you to misinterpret what you read. It'll cause you to ignore what you know is right. And it'll cause you to fail in life. Because what? He said, no, don't trust. Uh, don't, don't, no. In other words, he said, don't serve two masters. You'll love the one and, and hate the other. You can't sir. serve God yes, and man. Yes, sir. But most people say, no, I can do it. I've been doing it all this time. Uh -huh. And you know you send yourself up for failure. Because uh -huh. at the end of the day, what uh -huh. the enemy, Preach he's the God of this world. Preach he will trick you. Preach Preach he tricks you know. people every day. Every day. Every day. That's become slothful Slough. in the things of God. That's right. In other words, God, you know, is a what in, 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 in uh, Psalms, the, the, the goodness of God left the, the taste of my mouth. I, I taste and see that he's good. The goodness of God leaves a taste on your mouth. Yes, it does. That you can continue yes, to go out to. Yes, sir. Look what he says. The word of truth, the gospel of your salvation. salvation. This is the most precious thing he has given me is what? Is my salvation pact. And to make that work, one key I must understand is my way. My way. I don't care how I hurt for how painful, how, how hard it is. Gonna give it to him. Why? Because you know what? He knows best. He knows right. best. He's the one that comes in the midnight hour and say, yes, yeah. okay. uh -huh. I'm gonna take care of this. Because it, it, it's the gospel of my of, of, of his, salvation. his salvation. In whom also, after that ye believe, ye were sealed. See. With that Holy Spirit yeah. of promise. Yeah. The Holy oh, Ghost will begin to direct me a certain way. Yes, uh -huh. right. The Holy Spirit will begin to, to, to show me. The Bible says a word will come and show me which way to go. Which way to go. No. He said yeah. a voice will come behind me. Yeah. Yeah. Most people, if they honest enough, they say, no, I'll serve God every other way, but not with my mind. Not with my mind. And that's because a, a preacher, a, a family member, whatever it is, is causing everybody a distrust. A distrust. It's no wonder why on the very dollar it says, uh, yeah, trust God. Yeah, <laughs> That's what it's saying. It's saying because they know, whoever put that there, they know people ain't going to be faithful. That's why the right. taxes come out before. Uh -huh. Before I give my money, the taxes come out. Come out. That's right. All of it is set up in the United States uh, concerning the God yeah. of heaven and <laughs> that we can win and we win. understood. He says, the Holy Spirit of promise, which is earnest of our inheritance unto the redemption of the purchased possession, purchased possession. our body, right. unto the praise of his glory. The one thing that causes poverty in the earth is just not submitting my wage to what I believe. Uh -huh. Why would I believe in God for eternal life, uh -huh. but I won't believe in my life? My, my family. Ah, ah, you, want to go, you want to go to the hell that you won't get that to? Won't get that to. Why would I even want to go a place that I don't see? Because I don't believe. I don't believe it. I, I'm not going to do it. He don't need my money. Yeah, but you need. And you know, there's things that happen daily that cause us problems in my own life. Yes, Lord. Well, I, problems in the home. Problems yes, in the vehicle. Problems with the hill. Yes, it, it is a... a, a, a a barrage of problems that's going to come in my life as I live. And I got to have the understanding of the word in my ways to continue to what? To believe. To believe. To believe the word of the living God. You know, it's a scripture, we all know it. What is it? St. John 3.16, right? 
For God, God's going to live. Let's let's in John three sixteen. We we quote this all wow. the time. Wow. And then we we quote this all the time. Mostly everybody knows this. Everybody got it. Amen. Amen. It says, everybody got it? Amen. Go ahead, John 3.16. Yeah, John 3.16. For God so loved the world that he gave mm -hmm. his only mm -hmm. begotten son. Uh -huh. That, you know, he said, who saw him? Uh -huh. <laughs> he, look, 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 look. He, he didn't make no rules. Or requirement, or rather, he just said, Who so help? That goes out to anybody, uh, no matter what race, color, or nothing. Mm -hmm. He made it so simple that people can make it complicated. You gotta do this, you gotta, you gotta make sure you do all these for things for God to help you know. Yeah. There's one thing you gotta do, put your money down. Okay. I don't see nothing else in the Bible that says, I, uh, that, that caused me not to look good like. It ain't fasting. It's not praying all the time. Uh -huh. People pray all the time. Still happening. You know, right, right. Look at real life statistics. Uh -huh. People pray for you. That's right. You won't be praying a long time. Prayer is vital. Uh -huh. Prayer is, is is super good, but 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 without money, uh -huh. it's five hundred verses on prayer, five hundred <laughs> on faith, two thousand on finance. Two thousand on finance. Prayer is the number one, but prayer the prayer that ain't gonna give me. And you're going to pray like that, but you ain't give, you, you're not giving. And even as God blesses, you don't give according to how he blesses. How you bless. He's going to uh -huh. bless me with all those things, but I'm, I'm going to constantly buy things. Uh -huh. What is that? Uh -huh. Things they do, and I'm going to choke in me. Sure. You, you can't wear it forever. <laughs> you probably can't get the good thing. Uh -huh. You can't sit in a chair. You, 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 your body is going through wear and tear. That's why you, you can't take nothing, which is the That's reason why God set up life like this. You ain't gonna take nothing, not one thing. And then whatever right. you leave in that can, they might take it. I don't take it. <laughs> so what is what is life? Life is about the, the, the salvation package is based on that word love. love. Look at that verse. L O V E. L O V E. The Bible says he so loved so love. the world uh -huh. that he gave his only begotten son that whosoever uh -huh. believe ETH continually in him shall not perish. But what? But have everlasting life. Uh -huh. I mean, that says it all. He, he sent his son that I may believe that he loved me. Mm -hmm. and, and, and he gave his son the word of God. He said, I'll speak not my own word, but I'll speak what my father has told me. Uh -huh. And he told me to love him. How do he love? Get it. He said, he loved a cheerful giver. Yeah. And I pay close attention to the words that God say himself in the tent. Uh -huh. Now, do I need all these things. No, I don't need them things. They ain't do nothing for me if I'm not feeling good. I don't have no peace. Uh -huh. uh -huh. uh -huh. uh -huh. no. uh -huh. There's something about uh -huh. giving to others causes an overwhelming peace. <laughs> it causes an overwhelming, you know, a settle, settlement in your spirit. You don't need that much. You really don't. What you need to understand is how to be walked as being a cheerful human. A cheerful how much you give, give? Give it all sometimes. Give it all because you realize, you know what? I'm nothing. The Bible yes. says, yes, I can do nothing without it. You don't let a little, a little money come to you your love for God. Just like, I'm going to let this little, no matter how much they give me, how much the chicks do. I'm going to love it that much. Uh -huh. above, above all that my salvation offers. Oh. That's what it comes down to. Uh -huh. Everything that the Bible says that he's giving me in salvation, is it worth, is it worth above my family? Above my family. He, he the one got to heal me. He the uh -huh. one got to give me favor. Uh -huh. He the one got to wake me up in the morning. Uh -huh. He the one got to make sure I eat. Uh -huh. He the one got to make sure I uh -huh. got to drink. Uh -huh. But I can't eat. Uh -huh. I'm sick. Uh -huh. I, I, you say, I want to eat, but I can't. That's how you know it. Yeah, it's time to go. I know well, Danny said, like, one thing Danny told me was funny. He said, you know, Papa, I don't understand why he was saying somebody's sick. He was asked, is he eating? Is he eating? The devil told him, okay, if he eating, he's better. He's better. This when you can't. Can't. When you still go in the hospital and they, they don't eat no more. Uh -huh. You know, it's so wrong. It's wrong. wrong. But they won't eat. That's right. They're feeding what they say. They can't eat. They won't eat. You know what? 
They died. They died. They don't know anything. They ain't gonna hear you. Might have been by the last so long, but then it's, it's got to die. They got to die. So he even say, "Cut off." What he say? I feed you. I feed you. Yeah. He, yes, he said, you yes, will not by bread alone, but by every word that proceeds out of the mouth of God. That's right. He said, I'm going to feed you. I'm going to feed you. Then God, I'll bring some to you. Yes, then, yes. then, let's see, you, you, you know what? He has become greater right. than your way. Greater yes. than your way. He has become greater than right. the lame of your hands. Right. He has been the God that's the creator of your whole being. Yes, yes sir. He said, I'm greater than the way. I'm the son of the living God. I'm the one that they marched up Capri, not for my own sin, but for the sins of the world. Of the world. Look, no, if you believe you stand in poverty by your own love and life, I don't care. I want a compliment. I want it more than I want to up in and get up. No, I don't want a car that bad, a house that bad. He said he'll give me those things. Yes, he will. What's the funny thing? These things will turn you against God. Against God. You can't even get out and go to church because you ain't that bad. You can't even want to go to church. You're not going to get out of the You're going somewhere else. Away from the church. Away from the church. There's a reason why these things cause the children of Israel to what? Forget God. Forget God. Things will cause you to forget God. Yeah. And he's the one that said, come, uh, come to me. I'll get laid in here later. I'll get rid of it. See, the kingdom of heaven is righteousness and all those things will be added to you. He went up in, in fully obedience of the law up to Calvary. Yes, Not for his own sin, but for the sins of the world. He went up there and he knew he had to do it to please his father. Yes, because I'm well pleased with my God and son. He nailed the, the, the law to the cross. Now, he bruised the, the head of the serpent. Yes, it is. And then the Bible says he said, it's it's finished. It's finished. It's finished. It's finished. It's finished. I, 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 I did everything you asked yeah, to do. And I did it in straight obedience. Obedience. He never sinned against his father. Yes, sir. And you know what? For that, his father said, Get up! Yeah. All power wow. is in your hand. Yeah. Oh, God. Yeah. He said, I'll yeah. give my son power yeah. over yeah. heaven and yeah. yeah. earth. Everything got the power. 